Welcome to the new year, 2024. The year 2023 has come and gone, but again, it was a year full of drama, surprises, and even miracles. The former president of South Africa, Jacob Zuma, surprised many people by announcing that he will not be voting for the African National Congress come election 2024. Zuma, who is not new into controversies, joined a newly formed political party called Umkondo Wesizwe, and he is vigorously campaigning for the party to win the 2024 election and remove ANC from power. Zuma, who himself was accused of being most corrupt president since the advent of democracy in South Africa, is accusing President Ramaphosa of corruption and claims that Ramaphosa is leading the ANC to the wrong direction. You will remember that the name Mkondo Wesizwe is the name of the former military wing of which Zuma was once a commander while still in exile. The ANC today, under the stewardship of Cyril Ramaphosa, finds itself between the rock and the hard surface as they are trying to Stop Zuma from using the name Umkondo Wesizwe as they claim that the name and the logo belong to the African National Congress, but without showing any tangible proof of legally owning the name. Zuma, who many alleged that once he wins the election, he will regroup with the Guptas to finish what they have started, which is to plunder the resources and steal money through corruption and other sorts of nefarious methods. Zuma's political party claims that they've already registered and recorded a membership of well over 1 billion in South Africa. And the party is still growing every day to reach a membership of 6 billion before elections. How Zuma's political party reached membership of 1 billion in a population of only 62 million people. Zuma's political party, mostly operating around KwaZulu Natal, and most meetings are concluded in Isizulu.